All right, we'll start with Sarah Todd, Desert News. Hey, Jordan, uh, since Donovan and Mike have been sidelined, um, the way that George described it, they've kind of been like a couple of assistant coaches over there on the sideline. Is that how you've experienced and what have they been like? Uh, yeah, definitely a lot of communication, a lot of talking that they've been doing. Um, Don today sat on the bench and uh, was talking to the invisible team like he was coach, uh, like drawing them plays. Uh, but no, he's been all of them, both both of them just been talking a lot, uh, communicating. Um, telling us what they see on the floor, especially with me. Um, you know, coach been having me bring the ball up the court sometimes. And, you know, I'm, I'm kind of um, uh, kind of lost minded sometimes on what to call and what plays and stuff. So uh, those guys are always there to help and, uh, you know, tell me what they see. So it's, it's been a, a good little experience for them to see how the flow of the game is going too. Eric Walden, Salt Lake Tribune. Hey, Jordan. So you guys are down to four games less, left in the season. Tonight was the final back-to-back. -back. Um, coming off a, you know, tough win last night. How much of what happened tonight, you know, kind of the little miscues in execution, do you attribute just to, you know, fatigue at this point of the season? And, and how much are things that you feel like um, need to be cleaned up a little bit? Um. I mean, like you said, this season period has been tough. You know, a lot of uh, game, day, game, back-to-back -back game. You know, we, we definitely fatigued, but that's not nothing that we really looked at. You know, we tried to, um, you know, fight through that. After a big win, you know, kind of got a little like, I don't know if you want to call it a hangover, but you really like, we put a lot of energy into that game, uh, wanted to win. And then coming in, this is how, you know, sometimes you slip up on games. And you lose these sometimes. Um, you see, they was in the game with us, a uh, majority of it. Uh, we're playing hard and and um, you know making shots and, and defending. So um, it's definitely something we just had to really uh, fight through mentally um, and just keep pushing and uh, doing what we do. Um, continue to communicate defensively, and you know that's how we we uh, stuck out this win. But. You know, I ain't gonna lie to you. This this season has been uh, grueling and tiring, but it is what it is. We came here to work. Um, this is what we're doing, and uh, you know, we're trying to put out wins uh, when we step on the floor. Ben Anderson, KSL Sports. Uh, Jordan, kind of following up on that, you guys get kind of a nice long break with the play-in tournament before the playoffs start. Are you looking forward to that, or are you looking forward to the playoffs starting? Uh, I'm looking forward for the playoffs starting. Uh, but the break is going to be nice, you know, being able to get your body right, uh, knowing that you got to turn up the intensity, knowing that we got to put more time in, knowing that we got to, you know, go to the next level. I uh, feel like it's a level that, you know, we trying to find and get that identity as a team. You know, we've uh, been at the top all year in the regular season, but I feel like it's another level, another notch that we got to turn it up uh, once playoffs come to, to be that championship team that we want to be. Um, and it all starts with, you know, playing with, at that level. Um, you know, winning a championship doesn't start from, um, you know, just coming in and saying that we're going to win a championship. It's got to – you got to put the extra time in and, and do what you got to do. I never won one, but I've been to a finals, and I know that all those dudes were locked in. Uh, they had us all locked in. So um, it's another level that we got to reach to to get to that point. All right, that's all the time we have. Thanks so much for joining us, Jordan. Have a good night. All right, y'all. Peace.